So yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying this um, binaural thing. Binaural audio, 3D audio. Should sound hell of a lot better than the normal GoPro audio. I've been meaning to let the engine do the talking in this video, but since it's being kind of brutal on, on you know, traffic, might as well put in a few words. It's a nice vet there. 911 Carrera 4S. <coughs> Did I say vet? <laughs> Porsche, of course. I was actually thinking about a Corvette before that. I saw a nice video of uh, POV driving before that. And that's uh, kind of how it popped into my mind, causing the brain fart. But yeah, this will be the format for uh, the looming um, car reviews. We're gonna do POV. I think it's the best way to kind of pass along the feeling of uh, driving a vehicle, sight and sound. And hopefully with this new microphone, it sounds as good as it looks because the last time I did this recording um, with the hat, as you can see right now in the mirror, I hope, um, I like the video part but the audio uh, leaves much to be desired and I think and I, and I uh, believe a lot of you will agree that a big part of, of you know an experience of driving a vehicle is um, the sound so with this better um, audio it'll be much better to uh, pass along the experience because I got these um, 3D microphones that go into your ears because they are also like headphones and when I tested this at home it sounded like when I you know played back some of my recordings it sounds like what you would hear from your own ears that's how good it sounds like so yeah so <laughs> I can uh, pass along the sound of this traffic jam just as you would experience it in first person. Ain't that something, right? Fucking hell, let's just get out of here and um, hear some of these nice revs from the car, shall we? Go down to through River Road a little bit, maybe. And then a little bit on the highway, I wanted to see how how much of a uh, wind noise filter we we get on this uh, on these? Oh, that's cute. It's McLaren down there. Is that uh, PT's McLaren? I'm not sure if that's his name, but there's like PT Porcho or something like that. Who's on Instagram? That might be his. Yeah. So <laughs> these videos where I'm just driving are pretty fun to like, you know act as a vlog where I can update you on the happenings and, and you know, the, the events we're having coming up. Yeah, I'll, I'll take a right here. Or, I don't know. Shit. Just when I want to take a right, there are people there. I'll just go left here. And obviously to just appreciate the car. I, w I, I wasn't planning on speaking at all in this video, but since we had a lot of downtime with the with the stupid traffic jam and, and works on a road I decided to oh look at this styled out uh, Toyota 86 the louvers in the back looks pretty nice so yeah I'll be uh, filling you in on some details and at other times we'll just be quietly doing drives so you can listen to this.
And I guess car spotting could also be a thing. Like, I didn't even plan on it, but there are so many nice cars out here in uh, Richmond or Vancouver or wherever I choose to drive that we can also uh, kind of do <laughs> a random car spotting um, thing out of it. probably begin the reviews with the Miata right after that I'll do the bullet or maybe I'll even start with some of the um, member cars that we have on the form I have quite a few already interested parties Let me know what you think in the comments. Um, I'd be glad to hear any sort of feedback. What what kind of things would you like me to, to do in these drives? Where do huh, you want me to go to? Um, if you are not a part of the group at all, and you just and you've just like stumbled across my channel uh, randomly, then that's also good. Welcome. have a beautiful day today quite warm 16 Celsius or whatever that is in uh, oven units or American units <laughs> it's pretty warm sunny I'll probably turn around in McDonald Park. I don't want to go down to uh, all the way to Iona Beach. There's probably a ton of cyclists there and, and just parked cars. And like the speed limit there is, is so low anyways. It's pretty, but let's just skip that today. I thought about uh, initially just taking the car for a wash but then there's like a fairly rainy week ahead of us, so what's the point really? You can see this guy is also turning right into McDonald Park. In case you were wondering, um, the exhaust is stock entirely. I haven't done anything to it. Uh, it is an active valve exhaust, so right now it's on the most, uh, you know, loud configuration, most open. This is like the normal. You might see the gauge also is kind of changing. Even the normal is like <laughs> fairly loud. Outside of the normal, we also have um, 
the Sport Plus mode that opens the exhaust a little bit. It sounds a bit more raspy, a bit more sporty, a bit more louder. But you don't get the full experience of the pops and the crackles as you would with the full track mode exhaust, the one that I turned on right now. And it lets you be the judge and listen to it a little bit too. Let's go. Yeah, <laughs> it's fairly brisk and loud, just like I love it. I'll talk, obviously, more in depth about this vehicle and my experience with it. I've had it since August, and yeah, I love it to death. Oh my goodness, what is this? Jesus, why would you do that to your car? Isn't that like a hazard on the road? Like all that stuff that might just fall off your car? I don't know, man. Your car, your business, I guess. <laughs> At least it's good content, right? just a recommendation, I'll just do whatever the fuck I want. Actually headed uh, to TNT to get some groceries, get some fruit. Yeah, beautiful day. Got off of work not too long ago, so I got to you know take this car for a spin, do some chores, and you know share it with you. Ever since I got this car, I'm I'm really into chores. Do I have to go somewhere and get like some? cat food no problem here I go every time I'm like oh we need to drive somewhere I'm down <laughs> but as you can see with the mileage 
only 2,500 kilometers. I haven't been driving that much. Had it since August, so. Plus it now, you know, I um, also drive the Miata a lot. But I don't want you to think that I'm like treating it as like a garage queen or something like that because because I use this car all year uh, winter <laughs> snow whatever I even though like uh, I uh, should I say it I don't know yeah I'll say it I and I never like got winter tires for it because I'm never leaving the city anyways at least with this car and I'm like okay I'll just drive the car carefully gingerly and it did well even on summer tires and even being like you know a rear wheel drive car so I'm here alive and it's manageable I'm not gonna put on some wheels for like three days of snow not gonna happen Especially that I don't, know, I don't have to like commute to work because I work from home right now, so. so that's probably the biggest reason why my mileage is that low. That's nice BMW convertible there. It's a pleasure to be uh, driving again um, compared to the traffic jam we were stuck in at the beginning of this video. And yeah, feeling the wind a little bit. Maybe let's um, close the windows a little bit and hear what that sounds like. Because uh, yeah, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, it's a nice <laughs> downshift. It doesn't really matter, uh, as you can tell, whether you know the op the windows are open or not. You can hear the growls, and, and I wish you could like also feel the vibrations like I do when I drive this vehicle. But um, yeah, even with the windows uh, closed, you can definitely enjoy. Whew. Can I make it? Yeah, I can make it. Downshift. Oh. Tight Turner too. Limited split, uh, slip differential. Uh, gone are the days that a Mustang is just, you know, a car for straight lines. It can definitely uh, turn pretty well. It's by no means a BRZ or a Miata or uh, any one of those cars, but uh, it can handle quite well. I, I find that um, the scary part of it turning in. Um, high speeds it's actually not the handling or it losing uh, you know under steering or something like that it's it's just the power and, and uh, the wheel spinning under you if you go uh, too quickly those uh, new Hyundai's are uh, looking rather good I like the new design turn there oh well I can also take it from here <clears throat> once I um, go into TNT that's where the video will end I'll open the windows again so we can enjoy the engine with the parking acoustics. Oh, 
like I said, like, subscribe, comment with recommendations. Um, yeah, tell me what you think. Your feedback <clears throat> is very appreciated. And I'll read the comments and, and reply if you have any questions. And I'll try to take your uh, feedback to heart. What is this guy doing? Come on, man. You're literally inside the intersection still. our turn here here we go we go down here oh that sounds nice this is the part where I can just go down in neutral and give some revs <laughs> just for fun here we are plenty of space that's good I think I'll take this ridiculous hat off of my head now see ya <laughs>